simple as that and a lot of strength on display here. Shifting gears now. Welcome to Revamped Wrestling. Subscribe to channel and smash the like button. strategy they bring with them into the ring, the odds are they will always be stacked against them. And guys, if you're looking for fireworks on this 4th of July, you came to the right place because this match will be nothing short of explosive. Come on, Cole. You're better than that. Did you really have to go with the fireworks line? Oh, come on. Who am I kidding? Of course you did. The consummate underdog of the women's division, Zelina Vega. And representing the LWO from Queens, New York, Zelina Vega. Zelina has seen a tremendous amount of success lately. She won the Queen's crown and reformed the LWO. And Zelina's not showing any signs of slowing down. Zelina was no stranger to success before, but now she seems destined for the top. Sports Entertainment, Natalia always ready to handle things inside the ring. And very quickly, I can tell you that these superstars are very excited to have the opportunity to compete here tonight on Independence Day. And similarly, we're excited to be able to call the action for you, especially for this match. This is going to be great. This should be interesting, guys, as six of WWE's top names square off here. Oh! Agility like that, easier said than done, gentlemen. And she had Zelina's number there. She's staying elusive. Drop kick. Fire a shot like that to completely immobilize your opponent. She's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. Right across the chest. He wasn't tough enough contending with one opponent. Now you got to deal with two. Drop kick to the back. Never saw it coming. Oh, 
wicked kick to the lower back. She's starting to look concerned. Destructive offense from Natalya. Corey, what is the game plan for the women in the ring? Well, Cole, as with any tag team match, but especially three on three, teamwork has to be the foundation. They have to trust and rely on the women on their team. Can she keep her down? And she's not done yet. She likely knew that wasn't enough. She's just keeping the pressure on. You've got to be impressed by the power possessed by Natalya. Sit down, Powerball. The Powerball's not meant to be pretty, but oh man, does it get the job done. And I'm pretty sure they don't want to be taking any more of those. Tag made. Tag uh oh. Dragon Slaper. It's in. It's in tight. It's in deep. Rolls through, and she's free. Set right into the corner. Uh-oh, look at this. Oh, boy. Exploder! And she's in off the tag. Standing shooting star press. Sometimes you just gotta show off and show up. Those one counts getting harder and harder to kick out of. She'll make the tag. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Forearm. And Shayna was the one getting broken down on that exchange. That's the kind of ability Vega's looking to show tonight. Places her right in the corner. Punch to the stomach. Connects. Gets the tag. Natalia in off 
the tag. She was just looking to soften her up a little there. Tag made. She's in. Wrestling, bringing you videos on all wrestling reviews, recaps, and music video simulations. Like, comment, and subscribe. Russia, 
Weighing in at 187 pounds, Ilya Dragunov! We have seen before what Dragunov is capable of, and it is scary. Shifting gears now, i like to take this opportunity to wish everybody a very happy 4th of July. And if you're into fireworks, don't touch that remote because this one is sure to be explosive. Oh, who writes your stuff? The monster of all monsters is here. And his opponents, first from Sheryls Ford, North Carolina, weighing in at 385 pounds, Braun Strowman. Strowman possesses jaw-dropping size and absolutely staggering power. And not shy about using it here to cause some damage. And very quickly, I can tell you that these superstars are very excited about the opportunity to compete here tonight on Independence Day. And similarly, we're excited to be able to call the action for you, especially for this match. This is going to be great. Main event, Jey Uso. Yeah, it's just him, Oops. And from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds, main event, Jay. Not content with being the right hand anymore, Jey Uso has set out on his own path. And it's a particularly treacherous path these days. There are a lot of men who have a grudge with his actions in the bloodline that are not easily forgotten. Jey Uso is intent on proving himself to those competitors in the entire WWE Universe. And guys, allow me to say thank you to everybody watching at home for spending part of your Independence Day with us. Congratulations, Cole. I thought for sure you were going to say some corny cliche about there being fireworks in this upcoming match. You showed a lot of reserve there. Very good job. That's Byron's job. <laughs> the mangy mutt of the brawling brutes. And from Birmingham, England, weighing in at 205 pounds, Bush! A master of joint manipulation and technical savagery. You know, the old saying, Cole, you can't judge a book by its mangy cover. And very quickly, I can tell you that these superstars are very excited to have the opportunity to compete here tonight on Independence Day. And similarly, we're excited to be able to call the action for you, especially for this match. This is going to be great.
Here we go as we kick off this huge fatal four-way match. Predator set for action in this one. We have Ilya Dragunov, Strowman, Jay Uso, and Butch. It is going to be extremely interesting to see how things shake out. No time to rest in a fatal four-way match. No rest for the wicked, and we've got four superstars who have nothing but malicious intentions for one another. Nowhere to hide in this one. Devastating elbow. Down, trampling the opposition. Cover, cover. And the count's broken. Keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. There's certainly an element of danger inherent in a no-disqualification match, isn't there, Corey? More than a lot of people realize. It's not just the superstar in the ring you have to worry about. You have to worry about everyone in the locker room that they're aligned with. The odds in this match can swing with or against you so fast. What a counter! Satisfying his bloodlust a bit with that assault. Boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. Boom! Butch with a timely counter. Power for the suplex. Big impact to the back of the neck. Can he take it back? 
continues. My friends, we have reached the bitter end. Oof. Jay is out. That is it. Two. Kick out. I thought he was finished off for sure. An emphatic kick out from Jay Uso. How in the world did he get this over on? The next big move might end this. The question is, who has the stamina? This is what he feeds off of. Moments like this, this big match feel. And each of these lethal maneuvers have got to be taking a toll. Telegraph that one and delivers a blow to the gut. A little cock. No way! To the side dive! It's like a heat seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Things are about to get good. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, from Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, weighing in at 165 pounds, the Dragon Lee! The WWE Universe delivering quite a reaction, perhaps the most highly anticipated match of the night. And guys, allow me to say thank you to everybody watching at home for spending part of your Independence Day with us. Congratulations, Cole. I thought for sure you were going to say some corny cliche about there being fireworks in this upcoming match. You showed a lot of reserve there. Very good job. That's Byron's job. <laughs> is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. Ah! Ah! 
shifting gears now. I like to take this opportunity to wish everybody a very happy 4th of July. The black sheep of the Mysterio family, Dominic seems hell-bent on ruining his family's legacy. Oh, give it a rest, Cole. Dirty Dom has forged his own path. That's something that takes true guts. If you gotta say something bad about Dom, I'm sure he'll have no problem taking care of it in the yard. <laughs> okay. Goes into the pin. Two! He narrowly avoids the count. And frustration might be starting to set in. Gets out of there in a hurry. The wheelbarrow, nice counter. Wow. Great way to put your opponent on spaghetti legs moving forward. Boom! A forearm smash. Exploiting the arm must be the strategy here. Wow! Shoulders down, this could be it. Getting the shoulder up before two. Fighting hard to stay in this match. Placed in the corner. Wicked clothesline. Over the top. Great move there. Ducked underneath. What agility. Head scissors. Kick. Oh, man. He is more than fired up right now. Looking for the suplex. Dominic in crisis mode. Cover. Wow, just barely making it out. You gotta be kidding me. Surviving that maneuver is absolutely amazing. And it's gonna take composure now. Could just need one more big move. Springboard. Knees up. Knees were up. All the breath taken out of their body with that counter. Vicious right forearm. Great drop kick. He's got him scouted. Oh, what a hip toss. He is just reeling from that offense. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. The 619! And you can see the excitement building in Dominic's eyes now. He's going for the pin! This could be it! It's over! It is over! Here is your winner. triumphant win for Dominic. Yeah, and Dirty Dom making Mommy proud with this victory. I can only imagine what this celebration is going to be like. Welcome to Revamped Wrestling. Subscribe to channel and smash the like button.
Here comes the unholy union. Yeah, and they... Saxton. Byron, what are you doing? Get out from under the table. Get a match to call. Uh, leave me alone, Corey. These two women are self-proclaimed practitioners and scholars of the dark arts. And they're not afraid to use their dark powers to get ahead in WWE. Mischievous, devious, cunning, all part of Fire and Dawn's dark personas. And very quickly, I can tell you that these superstars are very excited to have the opportunity to compete here tonight on Independence Day. And similarly, we're excited to be able to call the action for you, especially for this match. This is going to be great. Guys, I cannot overstate the importance of this match here tonight. Of course not, Michael. Anytime the tag titles are on the line, the match takes on a whole new level of importance. And guys, if you're looking for fireworks on this 4th of July, you came to the right place because this match will be nothing short of explosive. Come on, Cole. You're better than that. Did you really have to go with the fireworks line? Oh, come on. Who am I kidding? Of course you did. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall and is for the WWE Women's Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers, the team of Isla Dawn and Alba Fire. And their opponents, Jane and Bianca Belair. The WWE Women's Tag Titles have quickly risen to prominence. When we see the dark duo of Alba Fire and Isla Dawn, we're looking at a team who's hungry and on the hunt for victims. When you call yourselves the Unholy Union, you're not exactly mentoring rookies. This team's not just dangerous. These women possess a power that has the capability to level the entire women's division. Fire and Dawn threaten to unleash scorched earth, and if they have their way, it can very well happen tonight. Each team looking to make an impact, looking to shake up the landscape of the tag team division. Well, I'll take it one step further, Saxton. These teams have a goal of dominating the division. Sent into the corner. Oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. The challenger focused on wearing down the champ's arm. My goodness, is this even legal? I don't think so. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Tag is good. Tag made here. Oh, this is going to be bad. And I have her fist right across the collarbone. Solid teamwork, but let's not forget, the champs have solid teamwork of their own, too. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. Focusing on a body part, picking it apart. The arm's as good of a place to focus as any. Punishing the leg. A classic strategy for a reason. Cutting down the... Here's a pin for the title. The champ lets his shoulder up before one there. Not yet. Yeah. 
She sent flying into the corner. Belair able to counter. Go for the ride. The follow-away slam. The champion just chucking the competition around like they're nothing. That has to claw at the challenger in some way. something. Tagged in. Twisted team out of fire. I 
Isla Dawn. I'm kind of worried. Alba and Isla might try to curse or hex their opponents. Anything to get revenge. Revamped Wrestling, bringing you videos on all wrestling, reviews, recaps, and music video simulations. Like, comment, and subscribe. The WWE Universe just exploded! The following contest is a six-man tag team match. Introducing first, from New York, weighing in at 228 pounds, the The feeling, the electricity in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt in quite some time. This match. We are about to see something good. And from Franklinville, New Jersey, weighing in at 249 pounds, Joe one day, this superstar is going to write a check that Trash Talk can't cash. Trash Talk? This competitor speaks your mind, but I wouldn't call it Trash Talk. Yeah, I agree. Also, Corey, just so you know, nobody uses checks anymore. <laughs> Shifting gears now. I like to take this opportunity to wish everybody a very happy 4th of July. And if you're into fireworks, don't touch that remote because this one is sure to be explosive. Ugh, who writes your stuff? And here comes one of my favorites. Some would say this superstar thinks a little too much of themselves, but the tape doesn't lie. This is a serious contender for any title. They need to loosen up, have a little fun, heck, maybe even... If I could be so bold as to make a prediction, someone's gonna get smashed. And representing the Creed Brothers, from Lexington, Ohio, weighing in at 285 pounds, rooted. Class is in session. Master Gable has arrived. And representing the Creed Brothers from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 202 pounds, Chad. Chad Gable, proven ability to teach and lead as the head of the Alpha Academy. A true amateur standout, Julius Creed. And representing the Creed Brothers from Lexington, Ohio, weighing in at 230 pounds, Julius Creed. This is a man who does not know fear. Or and if you want to see who can play well with others, put him in a tag match. It's true, teamwork needs to be on point to win one of these. You know, I always think of us as a three-man team. Oh, shut up, Saxton. I'd switch sides just to pin you. 
Oh, look at this. Oh, kicks. Capped oh. off with a big one. Just never had a chance to block any of those. Oh, my God. Tagged into the action. For something in the corner. Oh, he thinks he has it. Power right out at one. He's not even close to being done yet. Here he comes off the tag. Oh, strong impact. And Brutus might want to tap into his aggression after taking on that. Stop to the gut, too. These superstars face a unique set of challenges in this six-man tag match. Yeah, well, we've seen teams of three struggle before. It's hard enough to communicate with one partner, but two, you're in for a lot of work here. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Trying to take away that grip, that range of motion on that end. Oh, look at this. Muay Thai knee strikes. You can see that each strike drained their opponent's energy. Up on their shoulders. Down in a hurry. There he goes, right into the corner. A tag made. Double team coming. Heading up to the top rope. What are they up playing here? Doomsday Cannonball. Did Brutus clinch this? Him coming to the rescue. Team coming. Oh, look at this. The oh, flash. Nice. Looking for the victory. He's able to beat a two count. He's still got life in this matchup. Stomping. Ouch. Can't, uh oh. He's returning fire. Landing face first. Left by the turnbuckles. Belly to belly. Vicious. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Kicks out after one. Shows that this is still anybody's match at this point. Oh, man. Ripcord. Oh, my goodness. Nasty line. Both wrists captured. And oh, that was nasty. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. And Gable's hopes are waning in this one. Gable has to gather the energy to turn the tables. Getting him into the corner. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Nowhere to go, being victimized by those Muay Thai knee strikes. Stomping away. Punishing their opponent. Just relentless with this assault. And no double knees. He's getting a huge boost right now from all those chants and cheers. Got the tag. Got the tag. Oh, right to the side of the face. And the unabated offense continues. Yeah, now he has to devise a way back into this. Oof. 
Setting it up. Boom! Gets the tag. Oh, what a DDT! Wow. Oh, that should do it right there. A defiant kick out after one. Not quite enough to put him away. <laughs> Textbook fireman's carry takeover. Looking wobbly in the corner. Pinpointing the leg in the corner. <laughs> belly to belly suplex. Uh oh. Julius keeps him at bay. Up and around. Somehow still in this fight. Not down and out yet. Oh! Oh my gosh! With one hand! Heavy body shots. Whipped hard. Take. Uh oh! Able to give him the slip. Jeez, you might break a neck that way. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. And some effective offense with that one. We're going to see it. Good wrench power bomb. Tags him in. Running knee lift. Shoulders down. He breaks the rest count before two. If that won't beat him, I'm not sure anything will. is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Power ball! And the exclamation point. Oh my goodness! Have to head back into the ring now. Yeah, count's running out. And he slides him back to the mat. And tag, he did it. Let's go. Now to the palm strikes. Oh, look at the knee strikes. One after the other. Distress starting to show on Creed's face. Looks like Brutus is having trouble generating any sort of defense. And he sends him into the corner. Suplex! This is just brute power. German! Just pure dominance. to see here. Oh, nice assisted fireman's takeover. Got it scouted. Oh, he could put his opponent right here. It's over. Kick out just before two. Wow, I thought for sure that was it. Nasty right hand. Vicious in Zaguri. Hoist it up. Oh, and Suplex. Chad Gable with the tag. Across the top rope, all the way to the floor. Bam! He's getting fired up now, really feeding off 
this ball. Uh oh, suicide! Whatever it takes to win. Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spitting in the face of danger. The heart of these competitors is showing through tonight. The adrenaline is coursing through their veins. Coming back from that, guys. Beautiful moonsault. <laughs> wow. Did that just happen? Ah, oh, face first off the post. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. Surfboard submission, no! Double stomp to the legs. What are we about to see? Both wrists captured. And man, a knee strike. Placed into the corner. There's a tag. Tag is made. What are we about to see here? Carry nicely done. Pinning down their opponent's arm. Dropping the knee for more punishment. Got the tag. Got the tag. What a pump kick. Oh, perfect kick. their opponent now. Very unique takedown from behind. Transitioning smoothly and locking it in. Rings of Saturn. Oh, he saves his partner there. Man, that one was in tight. The sound of this crowd is deafening, and he's asking for more. He's taking a moment to feel the crowd, but he better focus on the opposition. Whipped into that corner. Pinpointing the leg. Ooh. Superstar can do it to pull him away. Oh my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Hoist it up on their shoulder. Fireman strike. That's got to be it. And somehow through the pain, Brutus is still holding the line in this match. Brutus knows he's going to have to empty the tank to put this one away. Oh my God! 
Travis Creed looking to fly. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. Taking flight. Brutus ball. Brutus Creed just ended this. Makes the cover. And he makes the save for his team. And a tag there. Targeting the stomach. Listen to this crowd. What a feeling. And these superstars are feeling it too. Into the corner now. Uh-oh. Left in it. Got it. Corner to corner. And they're not finished yet. Spine first again. Tag made. Oh, my God! Right back into their own corner. Climbing to the top rope. From the top! You gotta be kidding me! Big time risk pays off! The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks Whoa. like that. Oh, nasty stop to finish it off. Evading offense. wrestling reviews recaps and music video simulations like comment and subscribe
Central 4, one fall. Making her way to the ring from New York. The Superstar! A matchup like this, it's one that the locker room has wanted to see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. tonight. This is a match with major stakes. And this is a woman that has had a lot of talk around her. A lot of people wondering if the hype around her is warranted. Yeah, this is now her opportunity to justify all that hype. An opportunity to show why she's been creating such a buzz. A win here could do just that. And on the other side of the ring is the unique Ivy Nile. She's been compared to both China and Beth Phoenix during her short time in this business. But I think she's really set out to forge a path for herself. In football circles, Ivy would be called a spark plug. A powerhouse like Ivy, she's the product of a strict regimen and a single-minded will to win. She is, so to speak, a true diamond. Inverted DDT! Oh, that hurt to the spine. Picking the spine. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Oh, man, that'll bend your arm. Savage stomp right to the arm. She's got the shoulders down. Close to a three count. I am surprised the count went that far. Is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear, absolute reckless abandon. A steady stream of moves taking out Nile. Uh, he's got to find a way to put her best foot forward here. Corey, from where you're sitting, what's the path to victory for Ivy Nile? Nile trains like an absolute beast, Cole. And that's given her a level of strength and conditioning that's almost freakish compared to other superstars. She needs to rely on that stamina and drag her opponents to the deep end. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. She's taking some big hits here. Yeah, Ivy showed a solid game plan there. to reverse that one. Uh-oh, jawbreaker. Call the dentist. Ooh, what a forearm club. A display of force. here. This one was tough for Ivy Nile. She just couldn't overcome this fight.
These two need to think of the long-term effects that battling backstage will do to their careers. The long-term effects can be drastic. Anything can become a weapon back there. One of them could catch a chair in the face or get cut on broken glass. Even worse, destroy catering. Well, I pray that nothing like that happens here, guys. Lay down with a powerbomb. Oh, look at that scope slam. Hammerlock is in. Oh, what a DDT. He was waiting for him to make his move. Oh, God. Great presence of mind by McIntyre. Elbow drop. Piercing. Beginning of the end, CM Punk with the Anaconda Vice locked in. Well, this isn't going to win the f Kneeing his way out. And he's free. things around.
shovel. Straight pummeling them with it. Oh, man. You felt that. Ooh. Ooh. Crafty way to get out of hard there. Neck breaker after the float over. That was pretty. Averting danger with an elbow to the stomach. Kick right to the back of the leg. Here we go. Time to work out some aggression. Slugging away with everything they've got. Nothing pretty here. Just good old-fashioned fisticuffs. Toe-to-toe, -to -toe, treating each other like heavy bags. What impressive determination from both competitors. Keeping at each other no matter what. Each exchange just sapping the energy from these two. Absolutely savage. A uh, shovel wrapped around the head. He knows how to avoid contact. That dodge can buy Drew time. Good God almighty, that could end it all right here. Slips out of the way. Ooh, how about you take a shovel across your dome? Needed here as it looks like they've settled it themselves. Yeah, I just Damian Priest has arrived. A man who will bring judgment to all of WWE. The following is a steel cage match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Judgment Day. From New York City, weighing in at 249 pounds, Damian has truly embraced his deepest, darkest side, and I couldn't be happier. We've seen Priest and the rest of Judgment Day destroy families, put competitors in the hospital. What, just to get ahead? For Priest, the ends justify the means. And guys, if you're looking for fireworks on this 4th of July, you came to the right place because this match will be nothing short of explosive. Come on, Cole. You're better than that. Did you really have to go with the fireworks line? Oh, come on. Who am I kidding? Of course you did. Finn Balor is here. And it's time for the WWE Universe to face their judgment. And his opponent, representing the Judgment Day, from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, one half of the World Tag Team Champions, You know, Finn Balor used to have such a deep connection with the WWE Universe, but he's thrown all that away with this new attitude. I'd argue that was the smartest thing that Balor's ever done. Finn used to be the guy who let glory slip through his fingers, who fell just short of expectations, but now he's living up to his hype and much more. Balor famously became the first ever Universal Champion, but had to surrender the title to injury. And he's had some measure of success since then, but he's become bitter, he's become jaded. Uh, you speak lies, Cole. Finn Balor simply realigned his values. He knows now what he must do to return to the mountaintop, and he's more prepared to do so.
shifting gears now, I'd like to take this opportunity to wish everybody a very happy 4th of July. And if you're into fireworks, don't touch that remote because this one is sure to be explosive. Ugh, who writes your stuff? steel cage match and I'm not sure either one of these competitors really take down put it in the cross face gets cinched in this could be over how we're gonna free the arm and does just that The stamina is there to make it all the way. Trying to escape the cage. Nasty impact. Oh no, he comes off the cage and lands right back in the ring. Sometimes opportunities can backfire like that. Oh, Balor with the counter. Big knee to the midsection. cage wall is this the right time is this the right moment and now he's at an impact at the top of the cage he's working toward making his escape he can almost taste the win in this cage match he doesn't want to spend too much time up there and that could be the end of his career. This is the moment for him. This is how winners are made. Bam! Yeah. Oh. He's nearly there. Just a few more sure-footed steps, and he's victorious. All he has to do is drop down to the floor, and his hand will be raised. Oh! from the cage. Oof, kind of a rough landing. And that's what you gotta expect. Here's the cover. He forces a break before the count of two. He is gonna take this match as long and as far as he needs to. Hoist it up. And... Oh! Riven. He thinks he has We'd see a kick out there. Big slam. And now he's starting to make his way up the cage. Feels like it's opportune time to get out of here. Open the door, Rap. Open it up. This is right.
looking more and more likely for him now in this steel cage match. Fun so hard to be in this position, but he's only halfway to victory. This fight continues. Uh-oh. Face first. Goodbye. Look at it in here. This could be it. He breaks the pin before a one count. We're well into the match, and he still seems so fresh. It's almost unbelievable. Way to allow it. Now it is. Uh-oh. He moves just in time. Stone slam. Damian Priest just made Finn Balor a new victim. This could spell the end of it all. And Balor's being picked apart now. Finn Balor's under the gun. In search of some footing to make this huge climb. And now he has finally been able to reach the top of the cage. And would you look at that? He could be well in his way to escape steel cage. Oh, it's not safe being up there. Oh, he almost had it. Inches away from victory. Yeah, he really thought he had it there. Taking out. Here it comes. <laughs> Damien doesn't know where he is. Is it enough? The cover. Two. And there's the survival of this steel cage match. Here is your winner. Finn Balor. That was epic. Priest and Balor pushed each other to their limits, but in the end, it was all Balor. I can't wait to see...